hey youtubers something important something kind of damn important so uh, i'm the garage again i'm smoking a nice big ass cigar as in the big ass cigar for life look at that big ass cigar hashtag big ass cigar so anyway this is going to be uh i'm smoking a grand habano uh, lunch break crow joe number five Anyway, big ass cigar. Just getting on camera to shoot the check right now and talk about things. So yeah, today might be my last uh, smoking video on the marathon of smoking videos. So I did a video Wednesday night, uh, Thursday morning, Thursday night, uh, Friday morning, Friday night, Saturday morning, Saturday night, and now Sunday morning, Sunday night. I've done a hell of a lot of videos. So for people who say, oh dude, you don't do any tobacco videos anymore, well, you're damn wrong. You're damn wrong. Anyway, so I'm not trying to be like a jerk or anything like that, but it just, you know, for people who say you don't do anything, uh, you know, anything tobacco related, it's just BS. It's like, you know, it's just bullshit, you know? So uh, anyway, so anyway, I'm saying anyway a lot. Um, so getting on camera to uh, say hi, uh, I just had my dinner, my Christmas my Christmas Day dinner, so my Christmas dinner, so uh, which was another gluten-free pizza. So, or gluten-sensitive pizza from Bertucci's. I got two gluten-sensitive pizzas with uh, sausage and cheese, nice big ass sausage, like the big ass cigar, or as my friend calls it, snossage, you know, snossage. Um, yeah, so it was a nice pizza, a nice big-ass pizza, like a big-ass cigar. It was actually uh, made yesterday, which I know the trolls, you know, the idiot trolls are going to say, Ew, you ate a pizza that was made yesterday. You heated it up in the oven. Ew, that's so gross, man. That's a day-old pizza. I mean, screw you to hell. It's like, you know, I don't get the crap about, like, okay, a pizza was made a day ago. It's 24 hours old. It's been sitting in a refrigerator, a freaking refrigerator, and you heat it up in an oven, just like they do in the restaurant. What is so gross about eating that? I mean, you got to be a really, really damn picky eater to be like that. And I know people who are actually like that. I mean, no shit. It's like, you know, I actually know people who are like that. I mean, you got to be a wicked picky eater to be like that. Anyway, so aside from the idiot trolls, I will be, I actually got a, a really tr mean comment this morning, so I recorded it in my uh, vlog, or my, not my vlog, but my uh, notes, sorry, my notes. And let's just say it was an incredibly uh, mean and cruel comment. And um, I will be doing it at some point in my, in my uh, weird comment series, uh, probably not for like a year or so, but you get the freaking point. So uh, maybe a year or two. Uh, it just was a really dickish comment. So uh, and no, it's not about like pizza or any like food or anything like that. Uh, it was just a really, really rude comment in general. Uh, so. I am going home, back home tomorrow uh, to my apartment in Massachusetts. Uh, we say Massachusetts. Be so damn cold here, damn hot here, damn damn damn. Uh, and uh, yeah, so I'm going back home tomorrow. Uh, I have a lot of stuff to bring back, a hell of a lot of crap to bring, bring back uh, because I have all my, my presents to bring back. Uh, some of my gifts I'm going to leave in my, uh, my parents' house because uh, I'm coming back on Wednesday to my parents' house in Massachusetts uh, or running one off. Uh, Yeah. Yeah, some of my gifts I'm going to leave in my parents' house. Like, you know, like money, that kind of crap, you know. But aside from that, you know, um, you know, um, I'm going to bring the majority of stuff back. You know, like the, like for example, the soap, you know, the, um, you know, the uh, hand sanitizer, the towels, the face cloths, you know, the gift cards, that, that kind of crap, you know. So, see, so keep saying crap, 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 crap. So, uh, yeah. So I'm gonna bring back that stuff. Uh, there are a few things we're gonna leave here, but I'm gonna you know bring the majority of stuff back to my apartment. Uh, and then uh, this week is gonna be a really really short week for me. Uh, a really damn short week for me. Uh,
it's going to be a really short week because I work Tuesday, I work Wednesday, and then I'm done. So I know the dick troll is going to say, you lazy bum, get a real job, you lazy ass bum, like the big ass cigar. And, you know, screw you, you know, F you, whatever. It's like, you know, you're idiots, you know, you're total jerks. It's like, you know, oh, somebody just texted me, sorry. Somebody just texted me on Facebook. So, and for people who are wondering, no, I'm not going to add you on Facebook. My Facebook is personal. Anyway. Oh, wow, look at that ash. Dead ash on that big ass cigar. That ash. Dead ash on that big ass cigar. Yep. So, anyway. So, my dad and I are going to watch a movie tonight. Um, we were thinking about watching Chevy Chase's Christmas Vacation, you know, from the 19. Is that from the 1980s or early 1990s? I, I forget exactly when it's from. I think it's from the late 80s. But um, we were saying, you know, eh, that's going to be like a 90-minute movie, like a 95-minute movie, like over an hour and a half long. Do I really want to sit down and watch a whole movie like that? It's kind of long. I mean, it's a, it's a good movie. Don't get me wrong. Chevy Chase is fucking hilarious, you know. But it's like, do I really want to sit down and watch like a like an hour and a half, hour and 45 minute movie. Probably not. So we decided to watch the snowman instead. Not that snowman. Not the one where the snowman goes around and kills people. You know, not that movie. Not the Swedish one where uh, the snowman goes around and, like, kills people, you know, and, and tears people's heads off. Probably, you know, being silly ass like the big ass cigar. So, oh, Orburner. Not that snowman, not, not the, like the horror film. Like the, uh, there's an old Brit British or English film where basically, eh. <laughs> Tobacco in my mouth. Um, yeah, it's an old British film where basically it's a, it's a silent film. Not really a silent film, but it's more of a, uh, what's the word, where it's, there's no talking from the characters from the snowman or from the, uh, you know, the, the boy himself and the parents, and basically, it's all music, you know, it's all a music movie, and there's probably a word for that, but I don't know the word off the top of my head. Um, and, uh, yeah, so, we're gonna watch that Snowman movie, it's a nice movie, it's a nice short movie, I think it's like 25 minutes long, so, it's not gonna be too long, because, yeah, Chevy Chase is really hilarious, but it's like an hour and 40 minute movie. So we'll do that another time, maybe next weekend. So my dad and I, you know, Papa Smoking Essie. So anyway, <clears throat> so somebody just texted me again. Sorry about that. Somebody just texted me on Facebook. So I do kind of, I find notifications a little bit irritating. So uh, notification can get a little bit irritating, especially when somebody calls you on your phone. Uh, when you're, uh, I use an iPhone myself, an iPhone uh, 10 or iPhone X. Uh, and I find it a little bit irritating when, you know, somebody just dings you over and over again or tries to call you when you're doing a video. Uh, kind of a pain in the ass, uh, like the big ass cigar. Uh, so yeah. I had a good uh, vacation. I've been off since I've been off work since Wednesday afternoon, uh, and I'm going back. And, and tomorrow I'm not working either. Uh, so uh, tomorrow I'm just relaxing. Uh, you know, relaxing my ass like the big ass cigar. Uh, and uh, yeah, so uh, I'll have a fun fun day at my uh, apartment. Uh, probably I have an iTunes gift card, so probably buy iTunes. I think I'm gonna buy with my iTunes gift card. Uh, um, a old season of a TV show I used to watch. If people are wondering which TV show it is, no, it is not porn, being silly ass like the big ass. It's not porn, you know, freaking porn. It's uh, Beavis and Butthead. So, Beavis and Butthead is such a good TV show. You know, <laughs> be a little bit careful because of copyright, you know, copyright BS, you know. So, yeah, <laughs> hey, Butthead, hey, Butthead, <laughs> you know, it's a funny TV show. You either love it or you hate it, you know, you either love it or you hate it. It's one of those things that, you know, Beavis and Butt had a, my friend, my best friend who came over yesterday, he does not like that kind, of, that kind of humor. It's not that he doesn't appreciate me watching, he likes the fact that I like it, 
but he would never watch that kind of humor, you know, where they uh, talk about, like, you know, taking a big dump, you know, big turd, big dump, you know, uh, taking a big piss, you know, big piss, you know, or better went off, you know, uh, or like, for example, like, you know, fart humor, or like, for example, uh, you know, them walking around, like, you know, doing gross stuff, you know, like picking their nose, uh, or like, you know, uh, or like burping, you know, like that, so, uh, not really his type of humor, so, uh, but uh, um, it is my type of humor. I like that kind of humor. I'm definitely a fan of toilet humor, like potty humor. So, uh, I like talking about dumps and loads and turds and craps, you know, and big ass cigars and big ass dumps, like the big ass cigar. I took a big ass load, like the big ass cigar. Okay, I'm being kind of gross now, so uh, I'll stop. So. Uh, Anyway, um, I'm sure a lot of people appreciate that type of humor also. It's usually a love or hate thing, so. Uh, anyway, I'm just smoking my big ass cigar, taking the band off now. Anyway, yeah, so I've had a hell of a lot of cigars over the past couple days. Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. Wow, I've had five cigars over the past few days. I haven't had five cigars in a row for a damn long time. Probably since, uh, I don't know, geez, I don't know. I have no, no freaking clue. Yeah. Yeah, cigars getting a little bit mushy. Anyway, that's about it. So have a nice night, YouTubers. Pretty damn cool. Bye-bye. Oh. There might be a video that tomorrow morning. I'm not sure. I'll have to think about it just because I have to get up early on uh, Tuesday. So uh, I'm not sure if I'll do a video tomorrow morning. This might be the last video in the series or the last video in the uh, marathon. Anyway, have a nice day. Pretty damn cool. Bye-bye.